Me too. We Cirque were lucky to get tickets. Oh, don't they look precious? Cirque du Chevel is French well, Canadian. He is dressed up. Yeah. From all over the world and do very artistic things. Ah. Well, he doesn't need to see a bunch of frogs <laughs> prance around in tights and makeup wrapping their peckers around <laughs> each other's faces. Close your eyes and ears, Billy. Remember, you're a man. Oh, look at the funny clown stand. Yeah, we grandpa at home probably. Yeah. Yeah. Go away, please. Beat it. Ow. Dang. She never holds that for me. No, yeah, you're right. She doesn't. No smoking and no flash photography during Sakit de Suvre. Sakit de Suvre. How long does this thing last? Two hours. Two hours, boy. That's torture. <laughs> Maybe torture for a kid. Two hours yeah. for like six hours. You, yeah, it would be. But these things are usually fun, so you think a kid would enjoy oh, it. Oh, but not a kid. <laughs> Turn into a ship. Oh, a dinosaur. They like that. Reporting Romanian chicks rule. Damn, dude, you see how much money this place is raking in? Hey, we should start our own. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we've seen some clips of them trying to do like a circus, haven't we? Yes, we have. Uh huh. I knew it. They turned you into poopers. <laughs> they just need much time to do with their. They're uh, trying to learn to tumble and stuff, there. yeah. Kenny, you have to sing better. I'm tired, Grandpa. No, Billy, you're gonna stay here and watch more MacGyver. We gotta get all the Frenchy Foo fag nasties out of you. What? Oh my gosh. Whoa. Is there any possibility we could pay you for a place to sleep? Well, of course you can. Coming out of the snow. I'm your oh, Katie Bear. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. Your grandma's not a bad piece of ass. <laughs> Dad, not in front of Stanley. Oh, snap. Oh, it's good for him. Dang! Oh my Everything gosh! Thing you need there, do you? I was a contortionist too. You remember any of that stuff? <laughs> Ew! <laughs> what the heck? What the? <laughs> I have no idea what was oh going gosh. on there. Yeah, me neither. Dude, you're not gonna believe this. What? Hello. Hi. Hello. They're quintuplets from Romania. So if you're identical, does that mean you all think alike? No, don't be ridiculous. Quintuplets. Uh, they talk the exact same time. Well, not yet. Kenny has to get better singing. You know, through childbirth, you know, when like if certain women have like quintuplets, yeah. today's world, they'll just do a C-section. Mm -hmm. But I can't imagine how it was before mm. they was able to do C-section. Did women like even survive that? You know what I'm saying? They bring out like five kids. Maybe That's it was a good possible. question. I also think that the... The possibility back in the day of having that many like quintuplets is kind of not. Po I mean, it's it's possible, but kind of not possible because most of the time it happens through like in vitro and stuff now. Yeah. Okay. So I don't know if that would have like happened as naturally. Yeah. But it's still a good point. Like if you had twins or triplets, like back in the day, like yeah. Whew, I can understand like, like you basically twins. keep doing it, keep going. But, yeah, but like quintuplets, like would have been a lot. I kind of wonder what was the survival rate. That's a of good a point. Woman. That's a good question. You know yeah, Pushed I know. Probably was low. Yeah. Mrs. Mrs. Old Romanian woman. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Oh no. I don't know how to tell them. You tell them. Everyone who has a grandma, step forward. Uh, not so fast, girl. <laughs> oh, step. That's not the right way That's to tell them. Grandma is dead. This is totally awesome. Because now we can convince him to stay here, and now our circus will kick ass. Oh, of so course he just want to use them. If you'd like to come down and see the quintuplets, admission is only five dollars, and for a few dollars more, you can feed the What? Them oh my oh, gosh! This is horrible. Made it out of that armpit of a country they call Romania. Hello, this is Romanian father. I am desperate to have my girls return to me in Romania. I know, right? It doesn't That's seem like he's really their father. Oh no, dude! They said maybe. They said Romania, we'll never get our Cirque du Soleil going. You don't want to go back to stinky Romania, do you? It sucks there. And we might be screwed. No, we've just got to convince these chicks that America kicks the ass out of every other country. Come on. Uh, uh, uh. You see, oh, in America, we way. have log rides, bacon double cheeseburgers, sheep sharing contest, <laughs> and shopping malls. Well, shopping malls are pretty much dying out now. Uh, yeah, yeah, now. Must force them to return. Gentlemen, this has to be handled very delicately. Look, people have it so good in America that they get bored very easily. And when people get bored, they start protesting things. But I want <laughs> to assure you, and the Romanian people, that we are going to do everything in our power to make this all as confusing as possible. What the quiz say? Romania is gay. Fur is murder. Fur is murder. Oh, let's see. Wrong one. <laughs> So he's just like a, a yeah, like a. You must 
return the quintuplets to their father. Okay. Okay, let's try to get They literally beat up the soldiers. Stanley, we have some bad news. The courts have decided the girls must go back to Romania. I was say, I figured that was going to happen. They want to stay in America. I'm sorry, boys, but Janet Reno is having them taken away on Easter Janet Sunday. Reno. They are here to take the girls back to their father in Romania. You hop into the back of the house and find the quintuplets. When you see them... Why is it in a bunny? Hello, girls. Yeah. I'm the Easter bunny. Good. Ready. Go blue. Go blue. Hello, girls. I'm the Easter bunny. Yeah, that's not creepy at all. Oh, oh snap. That's it. Let's move, 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 move. Dang. Happy Easter. Hand over the children. Oh, go ahead and shoot me. I dare you. Pull the trigger, you little pussy. God, God. Oh, yeah. no. Because they heard a gun, so then they just started shooting, I think. The whole house caught on fire. Yeah. What the heck? Maybe they hear like, oh, no, yeah. The got the quintuplets. No more Cirque de Cheville for us. We just got to get that angry mob back on our side. Holy those cow. in here and took those poor quintuplets to the mayor's office downtown. Yeah, do we get overtime for this? So they're paying them? Yeah. Hey, we want to see the quintuplets. Come on, angry mob. Yeah, they just, they just like, trampled the two guards. No way. My house. <laughs> oh my gosh. Exactly. She said, Yeah, the worst. Uh, yep. Where are you going, girls? The only place we can go. We are going on Oprah and then a book tour. Yes, you can <laughs> Romanian asses. Oh well, doing our own circus was a dumb idea, anyways. Yeah, screw them. Kenny was never gonna get his singing right anyway. Whatever happened to Kenny? Meanwhile, uh, he's been practicing and singing like this. Yeah. Singing like Bocelli for dummies. Oh my and gosh. Now the entire piece, Conte Partiro. <laughs> Lesson four: The complete works of Mozart. Uh, let's start with some. Yeah, I want to hear that. Oh my gosh. Well, what do you think? Can you help him become a better singer? Well, if you want to be a real singer, you need to go to a conservatory in Europe. There's just no other alternative. Well, Kenny, if it means that much to you, maybe we can bus it to Europe and you can sing. Yeah, bus you to Europe. Yeah, that's not possible. <laughs> no. I was gonna say, like, how do you get the money to get to Europe? So this is how. You need a lot of money. Yeah. Oh, he's getting it. Woohoo! Oh, he's gonna end up being in the Romanian School of yeah. Music? <laughs> That's hilarious. How much is all this gonna cost? Don't worry, Miss McCormick. Romania is very poor country. Apartments are cheap, food is cheap, everything is cheap because we are so goddamn poor. They're gonna move to Romania. Everybody's poor like us. Yeah. Good job, Kenny. Mrs. McCormick, we would love for you and your son to stay here in Romania with us. Will you consider it? <laughs> what do you think, Kenny? It's like the opposite. You your yeah. Friends and your family behind. So, all right. Hey, sure. Hello. This is Kenny's dad back in America. He's I miss my son very much. <laughs> I would like to see him return to me so that the U.S. government will buy me a new car and now. <laughs> so I'm guessing there was those girls like that. Much. Maybe it really was. Yeah, yeah I don't know. Now it's told me the complete opposite story. Yeah, the opposite. And Kenny doesn't want to go back. No. Hand over the boy now. Okay, okay. I need it, lady. You've got about... <laughs> You just killed Kenny. Yep. Today, I am your substitute teacher, Mr. Wyland. Well, let's see. Mm, Eric Cartman here. <laughs> Kenny's in here. Kenny McCormick. Here. <laughs> it's gonna be obvious when you're ew. Uh, I 
dude, you know when you're laughing so hard that the milk comes out your nose? Bro. No! Oh, you have to be drinking milk for that to happen. Right? Exactly, exactly, Kate. Well, if you're, if you're drinking, drinking milk? Yeah. One of your classmates has been ill for several days. Kyle Bruflovsky? Well, I've been told that in Mr. Garrison's absence, our activity for the day is to make a get well card for Kyle. Okay. Hey, what are you doing? Oh. Now that's a get well card. <laughs> <laughs> they made butters. Ew! <laughs> Came over to visit you. Hello, sweetie. <laughs> Kyle? Well, well, the kids at school made you a card, Kyle. Look. It's poor Butters. Yeah. Butters, go on. Well, all right then. We're so sorry you're not feeling well. We hope you're better He's soon. He's covered in glitter. We like to say get well soon and please don't die on us. <laughs> you really are sick, huh? Uh. I don't know. I I don't know what to do, Sharon. They want to have him go into surgery. There's a brand Whoa. new shop in town that sells holistic medicines and all natural foods. Oh, geez. It's run by this fascinating woman named Miss Information. Why don't Miss you Miss Oh, get it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. You see, the reasons our bodies fail is because of toxins. But all your son needs is a toxin flushing diet of lemon juice and cayenne. Oh, I don't know that I trust that. <laughs> yeah, lemon juice and. Excuse me, but what do these toxins look like? Don't be a smart ass, Stanley. Oh, thanks for coming, misinformation. Kyle seems to be getting worse. Oh, I don't agree. He seems much better. Yeah. Oh my Those God, it's like he's getting worse. Out of his system. Now don't be fooled. Well, I guess Kyle's he's puking stuff out. More more of all the yeah, toxins. but I'm afraid he's getting worse, and she's but just giving them misinformation. Better. Oh, Stanley, your little friend Kyle needs a kidney transplant. See? Oh, that's what it is. I'll give Kyle my kidney. Even if it hurts a whole lot, I don't care. That's very brave, well, Stan. Match him. There's only one yeah. person in South Park with the same blood type as Kyle. <laughs> oh, snaps. Oh, shit. <laughs> Never gonna happen. It's funny how he's the, like the only one. I know. Of course it is. <laughs> I broke your space cruiser, Kenny. Jeez. <laughs> These are our two resident Native Americans. I'd like oh, to Native Americans. Americans. Oh, you got oh, oh, yeah. Uh, here, uh, this is a uh, dream catcher. Uh, those are those uh, guys, uh, they cheeks and charm. Um, oh, kind of, yeah. Natural healing powers can cure Kyle, but <laughs> the doctor at the like. hospital told me it can't. Everything's going to be fine, Stan. We're bringing Kyle in tomorrow to see the Native Americans personally. Oh, Isn't it no. Possible that these Indians don't know what they're talking about? Enough, Stanley. Nobody wants to listen, Kenny. Hey, look, they need a kidney. Yeah. I'm not just going to stand here and watch my friend die. Kenny, go round up all the kids in town who want to help Kyle. Kyle's going to live. That's it. This is it. Well, Clyde was gonna come too, but he said his mom was making tacos for dinner, and Clyde likes tacos a whole lot. He <laughs> likes tacos. Yeah. Take what is it Tuesday? Take Cartman's kidney. You can't just take it. Oh no. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Here. No, he's got a saw. Good pig. It's okay. <laughs> oh no. Oh well, we're busted. Shut up, Flabby. Aww. He need pay Poor pig. Deal. No, he didn't. No way! <laughs> Over 2,000! Oh, Stan and Butters! You're to take my kidney, are you? You suck, Cartman! God damn it! don't you care that Kyle's gonna die? I do! I do care! Look how much! Look, look how much I care! Oh Stop my going. gosh. Okay. Tried everything to save Kyle. Look <laughs> out! Oh no! Everything's 50% off. <laughs> He just she's drug no, him in there. Really sick, man. You should take him to like a doctor. Being in fact, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like dying, man. Besides, we're not actually Native Americans. I mean, I'm, I'm more like a, a Mexican. Hey, we never said we we're Native Americans, man. Misinformation said that. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna oh, find out that she's <laughs> fake and lying about all of it. So now, can we take her to the hospital? Yes, of course, but we don't have a kidney donor. That's all right. If you all help, I think I have a plan. <sighs> <laughs> like you could just do that and he would be okay. okay yeah. Give me back my kidney. It's mad. Now you're mad. Right, right here. Why, hello there, Eric. My asshole friend Stan took my kidney and I need to put it in. Please, it doesn't belong to Kyle. It belongs to me. Thank you. Hey. Hey, what, what's going on? He signed the con better, a contract or whatever. Uh, it was all a trick. Yeah, your yeah. mama did the kidney blocker and then we put ketchup in your bed so you'd think we took you. Oh, I knew it, see? It was all just a trick to get you to come in and sign this release. <laughs> I am so pissed off. I 
Look at his mouth with ain't on it. See, so he thought he was getting his kidney put back in and they were actually taking the kidney yeah. out. Oh no! <laughs> Oh, that was crazy. I like that it was supposedly the kidney that was causing him to leak the milk out. Yeah, of he's like, oh, well, you got the bad one. That's hilarious. <laughs>